What's up everybody? I'm going to show you an awesome tutorial today on how to change the color of your folders on your computer. Let's get into this. Now this tutorial is specifically for Apple computers, so if you don't have one, this might not help you. But, the awesome thing about this tutorial is if you have an Apple computer, you don't need any special programs. You don't need Photoshop, you don't need Illustrator, all you need is your MacBook Pro, or whatever Apple computer you may have. Alright, so we're going to show you how to make your folders look like these over here. Now, I made my folders black because I thought it worked well with my desktops. For example, this desktop has a white background where the folders will be, so I made my folders black. So let's get into this. What we're going to do is we're going to make a new folder. So the default color is blue. So if you come over to the folder, press on it, and you press Command and I, it'll bring up the information. You can do the same thing by right clicking on it and then pressing Get Info right here. It'll bring up the same thing, but Command I is the shortcut. Now this folder is gonna come up and you're gonna come over to the top left hand corner and you're gonna click on that folder and then press Command C. That's copying the folder. Once you have the folder copied, what you're gonna do is you're gonna come and you're going to search up Preview. Once you have Preview open, you're going to come up here, press File, New from Clipboard. Once you have the little color panel up, this is where it gets a little bit tricky. You're going to come down, click on this dropper tool, and click in the outside of the folder. Now it is hard to get any color you want with this program, but we're going to go for a red folder right now. So I'm going to um, drop the exposure all the way. Drop up the highlights all the way and the shadows and the saturation you can play around with that it looks like if you drop the saturation you get a little bit deeper of a red and the temperature now this helps you get differentiation of colors see so there's a little pink there's a purple blue Ooh, I like that blue actually and the turquoise but we are going with red so we're gonna keep that all right I'm happy with that red color right there. So what we're gonna do is we're going to come over, make sure the folder is selected, and then press Command C once again. Once you press Command C, you can exit out of preview, and you can save it if you'd like to. Come back over to the folder. If this little panel isn't open still, remember just click on the folder and press Command I, and that will open this little panel. And then you come up to the top left hand corner, press on that folder, and then press Command V for paste. And now, your folder turned red as you can see right there. This is really, really cool because now you can have a bunch of different colored folders on your desktop. So you could have a black folder, a red folder, a blue folder, and other people can look at your computer and be like, how did you do that? Because everyone you know just has the regular blue folder. If you liked the video, go ahead and smash that like button. If you liked it a lot, consider subscribing. Check out my description if you want to see any of the equipment that I use to film these videos. It'll really help me out. Doing these outros is so hard, I always forget what I'm saying. I hope this was useful information to you. I hope you have lots of colorful folders on your desktop now, and I hope lots of people will go by it and be like, how did you do that? All right, guys, if you missed the previous episode, I'll link it right here in a few seconds, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.